So the accents uh, of the UK, you can sort of trace them. So the Glaswegian accent kind of is kind of stiff and, you know, you've got that kind of very thick Scottish accent. You move across the area and it comes a little bit lighter and it, you kind of moving down even more and you get the jory light and it kind of moves into that and it's sort of a new castle and you, you, you're around there and you, you, you're going a little bit south and it sort of goes into like something more like that when you got that kind of Manchester accent and you go even further kind of like south uh, west and you kind of go from like that into sort of a, a Welsh accent so it's not too far away from Manchester so you can see how it develops so you go down south a little bit more from Wales and you get into a Cornish accent which sort of they talk a little bit like that, and a Cornish accent is somebody from Cornwall. Uh, so we kind of associate them with farmers, and as you come across the south and go a little bit more east, it sort of levels out a little bit to sort of this accent, and then you move a little bit more into London, and it gets a little bit more like that. So you can trace the accent left and right, and you can move even further north, actually, and go to Norwich in that sort of East Anglia way, and again, it kind of develops back into sort of Cornish accent, a little bit more farmer-like. You can trace the accents of, of the UK quite how they, they blend at certain points, certain words, certain phrases, certain intonations. Mm -hmm.